Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video. So this is literally the strangest thing ever because I haven't filmed a sit down video in probably like, I'm pretty sure last time was like a July haul or something like that. So it's been a good few months. I went into Primark the other day and they had a lot of Mean Girls stuff and I kind of bought a lot of it and other bits as well. So I thought I would do a haul. And the sad thing is, this is probably the last time I'm ever gonna film a video on this camera because obviously it's completely broken and I'm planning on getting a new one this Saturday, right now, as it is. So it'll be, I'll have it, hopefully, by the time you're watching this video exciting and also kind of sad because I've had this, I got this for my 16th birthday, so I've had it a good like three and a half years and every video I've ever watched on this channel has been filmed on this camera, so yeah. Currently all I can see is like a green square because I no longer have a viewfinder so let's hope our friend just looks okay and I'm just going to stop rambling so without further ado let's jump straight on into it. Okay, So I've got a big bag of stuff from Primark in Manchester and then I've got a few odd bits I got in at Liverpool the other day so I'll just start with the big Primark bag because that's right next to me. So obviously this is going up in November so I feel like it's completely appropriate to start talking about Christmas now but the first thing I got is the 25 days of Disney stationery let it snow advent calendar so this is a Mickey and Minnie advent calendar obviously you get 25 different items of stationery in there in case you haven't guessed um, and yeah this was only £10 which is literally insane on the back look away if you don't like want any spoilers but it shows you everything that you get it says it includes ballpoint pen mini highlighters binder clips push pins paper clips pencils erasers stickers notebook sticky notes memo pad sharpener magnets ruler washi tape so i got this because i really wanted to get the barble one but i already have a lot of the mickey and Minnie mouse barbels just because i've bought them separately like over the past few years so I thought that would kind of be a bit pointless to buy. So I went for this one instead. I was going to kind of go for a makeup advent calendar, but at the same time, I have that much makeup that a makeup advent calendar is kind of pointless because I'm rebuying stuff I've already got. And it's expensive. This was only £10, which is so good. And it's just a bit more exciting than your bog standard chocolate one. So yeah, that's the first thing I got. I might, very saying that very loosely, might do Vlogmas this year. I've been debating it a bit. So if I do... You'll see me opening that each day, um, but I just, I don't know if I can commit to like vlogging for 24 days straight because that's a lot of effort with editing and everything. I'll probably do like two weeks and then give up knowing me. But yeah, that's the first thing I bought. So moving on to the Mean Girl stuff, the first thing I got is the Cinema Light Box. This was only £8, which is so good for a light box and it's kind of handy because my light box actually broke this morning. So yeah, they're the letters that you get inside. It's all in like the standard Mean Girls font and then you get like the burn book and I'm a mouse and just different sayings. But yeah, um, I think you need, yeah, you need three batteries for this. So I'm going to get some batteries before I can use it, but super cheap for what it is and yeah it's been good so i bought it now the next thing i bought is a weekly planner to try and get my life together is that gonna work probably not did i buy it anyway because it's mean girls absolutely so yeah this was three pounds and it says like every week like your glen coco so it's basically i think it's got 52 pages for a year inside just write the day and then you've got monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday sunday and it just says so fetch i'm pretty sure yeah every page is the same inside but then on the reverse of the sheet you've got like a little thing i guess you could do some like maybe what money you've spent in the week on that page to do list shopping and goals basically i'm just gonna be doing this shopping bit and that's probably gonna be about it but it does look very pretty and for £3.50 another bargain i also got the pack of pins and um, so you get five pins in this for three pounds yeah i'm gonna i tend to put these on my makeup bags i've got a few disney ones so it's got mean girls the school bus and um, fetch burn book and you go glen co i'm not sure why that one's got a black back on it when the rest of them are gold but i mean whatever i actually don't have any working pens so this is kind of like a needed thing um, it's a four pack of pens which was also three pounds and then again it's got the same sayings on like on Wednesdays we wear pink her hair is full of secrets that's so fetch you get the gist and um, yeah and I think I'm hoping the pink pens are actually pink ink I mean it's not that handy if they are I guess but I'm kind of hoping that they are no they're black ink that's kind of sad but 
they will burn their pens and their keys. And to go alongside that, I got the actual burn book pen, £1.50. Again, just your bog standard pen. I can't take the lid off it because it's sellotapes on. But I use these. I have it's like one line a day thing, which I fill in. So I just tend to leave a pen like this lying around next to it to make it easy because literally... I come to do that one line a day thing, I look at it and go, oh my god, I have done it in like 24 days. And I'm literally going through my phone like, what did I do on this day? What did I do on that day? Because I can't remember. And then I got the three A6 notebooks, um, which come in this little packet. These were only £2, which I thought was so, so good. If you don't like Mean Girls, I do apologise, because this is probably like the most boring thing you've ever watched. But I promise there are clothes at the end. I feel like I'll probably share these with my mum, because she uses a lot of and um, these sort of notepad things so it just says she doesn't even go here and um, that's so fetch and i'm a mouse dirt again it's the same sort of sayings two of the notepads are just like ruled lines like that and then this one is plain which again is quite handy then i got the pencils so it's a pack of five for one pound fifty and they actually say on the monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday Good. and they've also got rubbers on the end which is all the handy because i make so many mistakes it's a joke and then this i got for my car keys so basically it's just a little burn book key ring and um, it's got one of these like weird hook things on i'm not sure if i'll be able to take that off and just use the normal keychain instead because i don't want them like really really long but we'll try and figure that out so yeah that was you don't have crap that was two pound fifty so that was a bit more expensive and the final mean things i got is just a pair of pajama shorts these were five pounds and they're just like black and pink polka dots you probably couldn't even tell if it was mean girls like if it wasn't for the little logo there they're probably not the best seen as we're coming into winter now but i still wear shorts all year round so yeah and then at the bottom of that bag i've got two things from superdrug because maybelline was two for 12 pounds so i've got the super state full coverage under eye concealer in the shade fair 10 i feel like this was about 10 pounds ish i wanted this anyway so that's what i'd originally got in there for and then i always use the lash sensational mascara so i got one of these i think they're normally like eight pounds but it worked out obviously being like two pounds this one's in like super shiny packaging i'm not sure why that is i don't know if it's like a special edition or something but i decided to go for the shiny one because it looked prettier so then this is all from primark in liverpool and uh, the first thing i got is the 100 oval cosmetic pads just to take off my makeup they're the perfect size because they're slightly bigger than the circle ones but you need more than one of them but they're not too big like the big square ones so yeah that's 90p for a pack of 100 so it's literally like not even a penny for one and i also just got a pack of their hair grips which are a pound these seem to go missing so much because they come in a pack of 50 i bought these a few months ago and look how many i've got left like they just seem to go missing i don't know where they go so i've just got another packet of them to um oh no you get 60 <clears throat> pin my hair back with and then the final thing i got i think this was literally the bargain of the year so the super stretch skinny jeans and um, they never have a 34 leg in a primark in their jeans and obviously i need a 34 leg because my legs are really long and they don't reach the end of my leg otherwise so yeah i saw these on the end of the shelf and they were in a 34 and i was like oh my god so i have to get them i'm pretty sure they're the same color as the jeans i've got on now pretty much but i don't matter so yeah it said on the tag that they were 15 euros because obviously they must have come from ireland or something so i was like mm, i don't know how much that's gonna be when i get to the till but most it's gonna be 15 pound it's fine and then the woman charged me like five pound 90 for everything so yeah these were only four pounds and it said 15 euros so four pounds for a pair of jeans was literally insane and they're so soft as well and then moving on to forever 21 um, Forever 21 is actually shutting down, which is slightly depressing because it's kind of shocking there quite a bit. But at the same time, that meant there was quite a decent sale. Admittedly, a lot of it was like shorts and stuff, so I couldn't buy that. But obviously, it's coming out of summer now, like we're going into winter. But yeah, so the only thing I got is this A line skirt. On camera, this literally looks bright orange, but in real life, it's much more of a like peachy pink kind of colour. And um, yeah, so I got this in a size 26. I don't know how Forever 21's sizing works, but I've just kind of 
guest and hopefully that'll be okay it's got belt hoops if not and yeah that was supposed to be 18 pound and then it said nine pound on the tag so i was like oh that's fine it's half price and then i got to the till and she only charged me four pound fifty so that was like 75 percent off so it was literally like bagging loving manx in liverpool the final two things which i've got are both from h&m so the first thing is this jumper which was 12.99 it's just this like creamy white color it is crop because i do prefer crop knitted jumpers and then it's like slightly high necks but not really because i don't like the like you know roll neck feeling i hope this fits i haven't actually tried it on yet but yeah, this is an extra small and this is so big so I feel like it's going to be quite oversized. And then the other thing I got is this stripy pair of pants. If you know me, I literally live in these pants. They're so thin and comfy and they're just easy to wear. We're actually in the adult section looking and then I saw these on the end of a shelf and they were like size 12 to 13. And I was like, mm, like could I maybe get in an age 14? So I tried them on these at age 14 and somehow they actually reached the end of my legs, which is a miracle because... I have the world's longest legs but yeah and they were only 10 pounds because obviously the kids they're cheaper so i feel like i might start looking at h&m kids more often just like how i kind of shop in new york kids as well because it's cheaper so yeah that is everything i have to show you in i was gonna say this month's haul but i don't even do hauls monthly anymore because i can't afford it so yeah i hope you have enjoyed watching it if you have don't forget to leave a thumbs up and subscribe down below and i'll be back soon bye